Hey everyone, this is Chris Rourke. I'm a managing editor at Star Local Media Newspapers, and here's what you can expect to see in Sunday's issue of the Louisville Leader. Uh, the Louisville ISD Board of Trustees recently met in a work session to discuss a couple of items. Uh, one of those was potential uh, boundary adjustments for some of the uh, elementary schools across the district. So we'll have a story about how that discussion went. Uh, the school board also talked about uh, possible changes to its transfer policy. Uh, so our story will look at what they discussed on that. Uh, finally, the Louisville Fire Department will be having an open house coming up. So we'll have a story uh, that previews that. So please, please be sure to check out Sunday's issue of the Louisville Leader and go to louisvilleleader.com for more information. Hey, how's it going? I'm Justin Thomas, sports writer here at Star Local Media, and I just wanted to give you a little rundown on what you can expect in uh, this weekend's publications. Uh, on the volleyball court, the first half of uh, district play wrapped up this week, so we have uh, some recaps of some recent action for local district teams, as well as a recap of the Hebron volleyball, or excuse me, Hebron Flower Mound volleyball match that I attended on Tuesday. Uh, district football gets started tonight. We'll have a roundup of all the District 5-6A action with Louisville, Hebron, Flower Mound, and Marcus all in action. We also have uh, live game stories from the Colony against McKinney North as well as Coppell and Jesuit. Both of those games figure to have a big impact on their respective district standings. We also have uh, Recaps of cross-country meets from last weekend. The, the, the district meets are now about two weeks away, so teams are ramping up for their postseason in cross-country and were on the courses uh, last week, so we have some recaps there. And we also have a little bit of tennis coverage. So all that stuff can be found in this weekend's publications or online at starlocalmedia.com. Thanks.